Well, good afternoon, YouTubers. Uh, I have been interested in things military for many, many years and came across this trench tool which I purchased and refurbished. It was in fair condition and actually made the handle. Now, this, uh, these entrenching tools were primarily were made for the First World War in English foundries, and this one's date stamp 1915 and it was made at the Chillington Iron and Tool Foundry works if you wish in the Wolverhampton area uh, that foundry commenced operations in 1862 or thereabouts so when the World War I looked imminent they were commissioned by the government to make many tools and this entrenching tool uh, was one of those, this is an original one they were also made in Australia and other parts and many, many different foundries. This one's in, as you can see, is in quite good uh, order. Uh, some were uh, actually had a fitting it to the top of the handle uh, where they were able to put their spike bayonets. So uh, oh, also there's a um, another web page which I, if I can find, I'll put a link to so you can read more about these entrenching tools and perhaps about um, foundries in the UK but uh, you can see that one there dated uh, 1915 also has the uh, government broad arrow there as well and they're extremely good uh, little tool for digging in the garden so I've used this one a fair bit and uh, not sure if it actually saw action on the Western Front in World War I but um, it's uh, made up for it by uh, being used in my garden anyway matter of interest and um, I'll uh, post this thanks for watching